Let's write a C program to find sum of all the even numbers between user entered range. If user enters start value as 5 and end value as 15, our program finds all the even numbers between 5 and 15. Next it will add all these even numbers and output the result. In this case 50 is the result and our program outputs this result onto the console window. So let's write the C program. I'll take integer variables start and end for range of numbers temp to swap the values of start and end in case start value is greater than end value count for loop counter sum to have to add sum of all the even numbers i'll assign zero to it to avoid garbage value collection okay now i'll ask the user to enter the values for start and end and store it inside the address of variables start and end so now let's check if the value of start is greater than end if that's true we swap the values of variables start and end we just want start value to be lesser than the value present inside end okay so i'll assign end value to start and then temp value to end that swaps the values present inside start and end in case start has bigger number than the end okay so this is the very this is the logic to swap the numbers present inside variables so even numbers between percentage d and percentage d r let me even display all the even numbers between the range so start and end now let me write the for loop for loop counter that is variable count is initialized to start this for loop executes until count is less than or equal to end value entered by the user for each iteration of this for loop count value increments by one so let me output the value of count for each iteration of this for loop let me compile and run this program so i'll give 10 and 20 so this should print all the numbers from 10 to 20 not the even numbers by the way i have not written the logic yet let me give 20 and 10 now it, sh it should still print numbers from 10 to 20 so that's why we swapped the variables value of variables start and end okay now let me check if the value present inside count is even or not so count modulo division 2 is equal to 0 in that case the value present inside count is an even number so let me display that onto the console window okay let me even add that to the variable sum sum is equal to previous value of sum plus value present inside the variable count so that's it let me come out of this for loop and print out the value present inside variable sum which has sum of all the even numbers between the range entered by the user so start end and sum so that's it so let me compile this program and run it so i'll give 10 and 20 once again now it should print all the even numbers between 10 and 20 and sum of all these even numbers which is equal to 90 so one more time i'll i'll give input 20 and 10 it should print out the same result by the way and it's working okay so let me give one more input that is 5 and 15 so it should print all the even numbers between 5 and 15 and sum of all these even numbers is 50 that's it simple program right so please follow the link present in the description section of this youtube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic please stay subscribed to our youtube channel and blog share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on youtube thank you